Hello and welcome to Science Visualized. Today we're looking at the reactions of hydrogen bromide with one alkenes and two alkynes. Alkenes have double bond. So for example, that one there, if you react that with hydrogen bromide, you end up adding H and B are across a double bond in a Markovnikov fashion. So Markovnikov means this hydrogen will add to the carbon that has the most hydrogen. So this carbon has two hydrogens, while the Br will add to the other carbon that has less hydrogen. So that carbon has one hydrogen. And you end up with this new structure. Now the Br adds to the carbon with less hydrogen while the H adds to the carbon with the most hydrogen. For alkynes, you get similar addition where you add H and Br in a Markovnikov fashion, but now this carbon here, alkyne carbon, has zero hydrogen, while the other carbon has one hydrogen. And therefore, because it's Markovnikov, this hydrogen will add to the carbon with one hydrogen. So you end up with that, what used to be triple bond now reduces to a double bond. And then you add the hydrogen to that carbon. And then the Br adds to the other carbon with less hydrogen, in this case, zero hydrogen. So you add the Br there. And as you can see, this almost looks like an alkene so you can add a second equivalent of HBr or HI. And then you end up again following the same method where this hydrogen adds to the carbon with the most hydrogen, that one there. And now I'm going to change the color of this so that you see that now the new hydrogen adds there and then the Br to the other carbon. So basically you get dibromination. You get two bromines at that position. And then you lose that double bond, so it reduces to a single bond. In summary, HBr or HX will add across a triple bond, where the triple bond is then reduced to a double bond with the H and X added across the double bond. And then you add the second equivalent, and now you end up with the two Brs on the same carbon. Thank you. Please support the channel by subscribing.